then the flu shot's actually going to go in this leg. Okay. There are um, problems with children trying to drag your child to tell them that they're going to get a shot. Boy, ready? One, two, three. You know, you're, you're going to be struggling to pull them out of the car and to, you know, get them into the office. Well, now we have a flu vaccine for children over the age of two. They don't have to get a shot. They can get a spray in their nose, so long as they don't have any other respiratory problems. Are you okay? Get you feeling better? You have to understand that uh, influenza is one of the most severe infections that hit our country each and every year. It is one of the most common causes of death around the world and uh, it's something that we have to take very seriously. We get them every year. Yep. We as parents need to make sure we keep them healthy by getting them their immunization. The purpose of the flu shot is to prevent you from getting really, really sick and dying from the influenza. And all the flu vaccines do that. The problem we've been having is that there's always been, you know, there's always an excuse or reasons that people have been using not to get the, their flu vaccine. And so we're not having a one shot designated for one person and then a totally different shot designated for a totally different person. And that's not feasible, at least not at this point in time. But what we do know is that we see a lot of people who have egg allergies. And so now we have a eggless flu vaccine. Okay, take a quick listen to you here. If we double or triple the dose, we definitely see a augmented response from those individuals who are older. The strains change. Uh, and that means that we have to adapt our vaccine to the strains that are going on right now. I will tell you that the strains that are circulating throughout the United States are uh, exquisitely matched to the vaccines. And so the vaccines are working very well against the, the common strains that we're seeing throughout the United States. You okay?